spend the rest of my life with the same one, same one. Ain't no I and T. I'ma bring you good love, just come with me. Baby, you're all the company. Girl, hey, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It is your favorite girl, A Marie. And today's video, you guys. We got ourselves a Sephora haul, okay? <laughs> it's not a big haul, you guys, not at all. I just picked up some products that I felt like I needed. Now, Sephora did give me the option of getting my birthday gift online. So that's what I did, even though I actually got a birthday gift in store. So I took the opportunity and grabbed it. So while I was there, I said, you know what? Let me go ahead and pick up some products that I wanted to review for you guys. And yeah, that's exactly what happened here. I did not buy a lot, but I thought it was still worth a 2021 Sephora haul. If you guys wanna see what all I got in my Sephora haul, then just keep watching, but before we go any further, I would love for you guys to hit the subscribe button as well as the notification bell. Leave me a comment down below and give this video a thumbs up. Okay? Okay. Let's just go ahead and start off with the, Chris the Christmas. Girl, let's start off with the birthday gift. I did pick up the NARS Laguna birthday set. Okay, so I did go ahead and pick up the Laguna birthday set. And y'all, I thought it was super cute. It comes wrapped in this box. I don't think Laguna is going to be my actual contour shade, I don't believe. But we probably can use it for an eyeshadow. So here's what she looks like. Super freaking cute. You guys, nine times out of ten, this is going to be a eyeshadow color for, for me. So, yeah, you can't even see it. Can't see it at all. It's like swatched right there. But, she smells good. She has a cute little mirror on her. So, we're going to use this for a eyeshadow. And we also got this cute little lipstick which the words are super tiny even with my glasses on honey oh the afterglow lip balm okay so this is super cute okay first let me show you guys i'm so rude let me show you guys how cute this is like are you kidding me you guys know i love minis and this is just super freaking cute so here's what afterglow lip balm look like okay she's very sheer you can't even really see her you can see the so that was my birthday gift i did go ahead and pick up the charlotte tilbury's um is this the all over face powder what are these called the charlotte tilbury airbrush flawless finish complexion perfecting micro powder Everybody on YouTube loves this, so I decided, like, why not try the mini before you go and spend all that money on Charlotte Tilbury? So, that's what your girl did. And honestly, you guys, for this thing to be this little, it was 25 bucks. okay? So, <laughs> I did get number four deep. I thought this would be a good way to test it out and see if I like it. So I was like, I want to be bougie too. I want to use it. I want to I wanna be a Charlotte Tilbury girl. You know what I'm saying? So that's what your girl did. I just picked up the mini. And you guys know I'm like a mini freak. So it, you know, wasn't out of the norm for me. I'd rather try out the mini than to spend, I think that item is like maybe $60 full size. So, before I just, you know, go too crazy, try out the mini, okay? So, the other mini I got is the, oh, this is Tarte C Surfer Curl Volumizing Mascara. Yeah, I don't know if I bought this. 
maybe this was a freebie or something i'm not quite oh it has to be the freebie because i was able to get two freebies i believe yeah she looks like this probably ain't gonna be able to see i won't open it just yet because i already have too many mascaras open and the other no that wasn't a mini you guys because here's the minis i got the wishful honey balm this is a lavender honey nectar nectar and mead turmeric jelly moisturizer it's a sample i never tried wishful products so that was just a way to try it and then i picked up the laneige water bank moisture cream and they gave me two so i don't know where that tart comes from but i also picked up the milk makeup hydro grip set and refresh setting spray i also grabbed a mini because you guys mm -mm. i bought the primer and i still have yet to open it if you guys remember me hauling that primer as well as talking about it in my declutter series as well as talking about it coming into 2021 i cannot open that thing so i got upset and i said you know what let's just purchase the mini size of the setting spray and let's hope it works as well as let's hope i like it because you guys know i like to be set and i mean pump for the whole day not having to touch up so hopefully this one works and hopefully i like it everybody talks about it. oh yeah it works oh nice mister yeah okay hopefully i like it because a lot of people on youtube loves this stuff so i wanted to try it of course i'm trying to be in the cool girls click okay so for the start of the show you guys fancy beauty has came out with the pro filter soft matte powder foundations and this is what i was going for to review for you guys so i picked up two <laughs> i picked up two because i went off of andrea renee's um shade match and i did not know she got the shade for for 10. <clears throat> Yeah, she got the shade 410, and I think this is like a deep neutral type of color. So, I was like, you know what? Mm. You know, because I'm not a neutral girl, but looking at it, it's not all that neutral. So, this may work. Um, this one, like I said, is 410. I want to do my own review for you guys. I know everybody has done the reviews. I know I'm late to the party, but baby girl... Y'all got to give me some time. So I also picked up shade 400 because I thought maybe 400 was more of a warmer tone and not neutral. So yeah, I picked up 400. And yeah, she looks like she's going to work too. So when I go to do the review, I'm going to do 400 on one side and 410 on the other side. And we're going to judge together which one actually makes more sense to us and matches better okay so that was really it for this 2021 sephora haul <laughs> that was it i told you guys it wasn't anything big it was just something to you know jump start me into 2021 now i will have to push those Fenty beauty powders in front of some other videos because i don't want to wait too late to give you guys my opinions and thoughts on it so be on the lookout for that video to come like really quickly um because i don't want to miss you know the chance of the views and things and you guys since everybody is still looking at fenty beauty's new powder foundations i want to go ahead and give my honest opinion about it as you guys see i bought everything with my own money so it's not sponsored or anything like that which none of my videos are sponsored okay let's just get that out there right now so hopefully you guys are here for the review i will be using 
most of these products in the upcoming Fenty review. So that is all. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Until the next video, I love you all. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will catch y'all in the next one. Deuces. Trying to spend the rest of my life with